Dude, this is crazy. What is going on, you beautiful human being? Welcome back to my channel. Today, we're reacting to Attack on Titan episode 79 called Memories of the Future. If you like the video, smash the like button. Let's just jump straight into this. Yeah, so yesterday was crazy. Um, like Zeke, they touched foreheads like that. I mean, the episode is called Memories of the Future. So that, that in itself is trippy. But what are we actually going to see? Oh, so that's Zeke. Oh, so they're seeing memories now. That's obviously Aaron when he was a baby. Oh. The father's memories. Oh, because he wants to make him see. How Grisha Yeager brainwashed and planted the seeds of nationalism in you. But I mean, somehow Aaron got a, a shave. Oh, yeah, because he left the others. Well, he, like, you know, he made it seem like he didn't have a family before that, in a way. Because, I mean, he still had that photo in his pocket. This is the true him. To hunt down the king and steal the founding titan. But, I mean, do they not take into account, or at least Zeke, does he not take into account Aaron Kruger's Memories are in him as well. I was wrong. I never should have been born. <laughs> He's not going to believe him that quickly. No need to rush. <laughs> Hunt. Um, Hunts. Hannes. Completely forgot the guy's name already. He tracked it down this soon. On the day the walls fell. Damn, so Zeke is gonna see things that he never knew before as well, if you think about it. You know, he's seeing like a a father that has emotion and not like the heartless one that he was raised with. Oh, he loved his second son enough to delay his restorationist mission. Seems he learned from his past mistakes. This episode is very interesting, very quickly. Oh my word, Zeke. <gasps> what? You can see him. Oh, okay, this is weird. Let's see. Oh. That old bearded man can't possibly be Zeke. Like I said, Zeke is gonna rumbling, rumbling. Ah! Nine years old. To think you were never brainwashed by him. Why did you betray me? Why do you oppose ending the conflict? That is the big question. What was his plan? I am who I've always been. From the moment I was born. I'll steal theirs first. 
Oh yeah, cause he killed those guys. A convenient, a convenient little brother to share your emotional scars with. His father's actions opened his son's eyes. And now he's gonna... Yeah, I don't know. Remember Mikasa. But I'll never abandon you. The basement. Man, it's kind of weird how, like, from that moment onwards, like, everything just got so strange. And now we're here. <laughs> what do you want? <laughs> like I'm saying, he's seeing these memories again. So it must like hit him like the fact that he said those things to Mikasa. Because he obviously didn't mean them. <laughs> yeah, when she snitched on him. <laughs> and then he says I'll show you the basement when I come back but there is some like i won't say holes but there is some things that still don't make sense to me right because like when his father does eventually see him then he's like you've never been the same since mom died but they never saw each other in between there so how would he know how his dad has been but even in that statement, you have to kill the Titans. Like, did he just forget that the Titans were being made by Mali? We mustn't escape our sins. So here we're hearing her speak for the first time in the scene. The world shall again become hell. The that girl and I on the same page. Oh, yeah. Crushed the little kids and smeared them like bugs. Because you erased all their memories. We can prevent more lives being stolen beyond the walls. But now you see, like, if the founder, like, you know, if they use the power to not have them fight, like, there's nothing that can change them. Wow. Yeah, it's pointless because it's like, they're literally locked in chain. Like, as you saw in that place. Each of the nine titans has its own special trait. Have never bowed to anyone. To fight the king's self-righteousness. But his titan looks cool. With the beard and stuff. 
この記憶に導かれた。進撃の巨人は未来の提唱者の記憶をも覗き見ることができる。つまり。未来。Oh my gosh, it's able to know the future. Oh, this is why Aaron Kruger. Oh wow, this is why he knew about Mikasa and Armin. I've never heard about. Oh my gosh, now it makes sense. You can't fully use the Titan's powers either. And end the royal blood. Bloodline. <clears throat> what? He never did it. I'm a doctor who saves lives. Wait, what is going on here, bro? The past can't just change. So how? Dude, this is like a curveball. I don't know what is to expect now. Oh my gosh. How can it be that Aaron is the one who told him? Wow, dude, I, you keep moving forward even if you die, even after death. Aren't you the one who started this story? Wow, okay, now I'm just completely confused. How is it that Aaron... Okay, let me just shut up and see what the hell is going on here. And Zeke's like, completely confused. Are you telling me that it was Aaron all along, bro? I killed him. Wow. Oh my gosh, and he's talking to Aaron. Why won't you show me everything? Dude, this is crazy. You're there, aren't you, Zeke? Only Aaron will get what he wants. Dude, what on earth? I saw Aaron's memories of what comes next. But I never imagined it would be so terrible. Is that you? This is insane. I was a terrible father. Oh my gosh. Zeke, I love you. Dude, this has taken a completely different turn. And I'm not sure if I even understand everything at this point. Please stop Aaron. What? And are they back there? Oh my gosh, he is him. <laughs> wow, okay, now I see. Because someone yesterday told me that, like, let's see if, you, if I have, like, that same opinion in this episode. And now I can see why. Because Aaron is him. But I mean, obviously I still don't fully understand why that is. 
But I mean, just, I mean, man, these episodes are just leaving me completely speechless. But essentially, they got the memories of the future. And the reason they can do it is because, like, Aaron is the one who has, you know, the Attack Titan, which can see the future, which can basically see the memories of the people who are going to have the Attack Titan in, in the future. So what that means essentially is that um, Aaron Kruger, <clears throat> the reason why he could see, well, why he was talking about Armin and Mikasa was because he was seeing Aaron's memories because that who, that's who was going to inherit the Attack Titan one day. And um, I mean, just crazy. But then it's like, it's like, it's such a weird twist because how is like Aaron the one who told oh right okay now it's man this is so crazy but i see now so aaron's dad basically saw the memories of aaron so that's why he was able to talk about it now was aaron the one who directly told him to do it we don't know that he might have just been influenced by aaron's memories of like the future and then done it on his own accord type of thing i don't know it's absolutely insane but now it's like twisted again now it's like zeke is back on the floor and aaron is the one standing like this who knows like what's going on though but man i just have to keep watching i'm trying to figure it out i mean yesterday i couldn't even sleep i swear i was like tossing and turning thinking about the show it's like it's insane it's a really good twist and we'll have to see what happens with it but man, I wish I could say more, but I'm just going to have to sit here and like be thinking about it. But anyways, that's going to be it for me. If you like the video, smash the like button and subscribe if you want. I'm going to leave the last episode right up over here. Thanks for watching. If you're watching, I'm out. Peace. In a bit.